Prince Harry has been able to confide in brother Prince William as he struggles to adjust to his new life in Los Angeles, with wife Meghan Markle. Us Weekly reports. Harry and Meghan moved to LA after completing their final royal engagements in the UK back in March. They left just before the UK was sent into lockdown, meaning Harry was miles away from Prince Charles when he tested positive for the coronavirus. Charles has since recovered and is spending lockdown in Scotland with Camilla, the Duchess of Cornwall. However, it seems living so far away from the royal family has not been the only concern for Harry. Speaking to Us Weekly, a source, who is not named, claimed being in contact with Prince William has helped Harry with the many challenges with his life-changing move to L.A. They said, moving to a completely different country is never easy for anyone, including Harry. And he wasn't expecting to be faced with so many obstacles, says the insider. As he settles into his life in the U.S., including the security challenges celebrities face in L.A., Harry has been in touch with his older brother. They are back on speaking terms after reportedly having a rift earlier on this year. Williams advised Harry to return to London or move elsewhere, somewhere safer, the insider said. He's concerned about his brother's well-being and safety. Harry has also been in regular contact with grandmother Queen Elizabeth II during this transitional period. The source claimed the 94-year-old monarch has been reaching out to Harry to see if he's okay and has offered to help out if needed. The insider went on to say Harry had unrealistic expectations of what life in L.A. would be like. They even claimed the prince saw L.A. through rose-colored glasses according to Us Weekly. Harry and wife Meghan Markle have considered moving elsewhere, but the insider said that they're staying put in California for now. On January 8, Harry and Meghan announced their plan to stand down as senior members of the royal family. They said their decision came after many months of reflection and internal discussions. The couple said they would split their time between the UK and North America before the coronavirus struck the both areas. After reaching an agreement on Megxit in January, the Queen released a moving statement. The statement read, Following many months of conversations and more recent discussions, I am pleased that together we have found a constructive and supportive way forward for my grandson and his family. Harry, Meghan and Archie will always be much-loved members of my family. I recognize the challenges they have experienced as a result of intense scrutiny over the last two years and support their wish for a more independent life. I want to thank them for all their dedicated work across this country, the Commonwealth and beyond, and am particularly proud of how Meghan has so quickly become one of the family. She added, it is my whole family's hope that today's agreement allows them to start building a happy and peaceful new life. Meanwhile, Prince William and Kate have been busier than ever supporting the nation during the coronavirus pandemic. They have continued to attend royal engagements via video calls and have been in touch with frontline staff raising awareness for any concerns they may have.